Hi, my name is Mara. And I'm Alexandra. And we are co-leads for the project How to Start a Startup at the Faculty of Law. The project is very much uh, focused on building interactions between our students and the startup community in Copenhagen. So during the semester, students um, uh, encounter or review the entire life cycle of a startup. So we take them through all the phases that startups uh, experience. Um, from creating a company or starting with an idea, protecting an idea, reviewing what are the tax elements to growing the company. And later on, as the course proceeds, uh, students also start to work with startups. Um, and each student is paired with uh, another startup that is active here in Copenhagen. And these startups are usually startups that are active within the fintech or legal tech or art tech. Uh, so they can be very much, uh, students can very much choose which kind of startups they want to work with. I do think that not a lot of students get a really hands-on opportunity while being at school and also having the chance to do it under the supervision of staff. So it was a great way of transitioning, I think, from a purely academic setting to a more practical setting and where uh, you could actually see how um, the law can be an enabler, but also uh, a, a barrier to some of these startup uh, projects. The fact that we have to actually talk with founders and CEOs and their perspectives and their challenges, it makes, at least for my part, makes it much easier to actually understand the stuff that we read about and go through and just, yeah, perspective is probably a key here. In the end, uh, I could see the, very much the benefits of the course in my uh, entrepreneurship uh, attitude towards a professional life and personal life as well, about communication, about how to solve problems, how to structure problems, and how in the end uh, to see, uh, to realize that the problem is not legal, sometimes the problems are more business uh, oriented. It's a way of, of getting new perspective on your business uh, and, and the opportunity to actually get students in with some basic knowledge of, uh, of law that can actually help you move your business forward or at least put some critical questions to you uh, is, uh, is extremely valuable for a startup. Otherwise, you just end up running in, in one direction and it's always good to get, uh, to get other feedback and get, uh, get new inputs that can, that can help you shape the way you are running the startup. It's, it's relevant because we put theory into practice. So we, we get uh, theory uh, from, from the students and we put them into the, the practicalities of, of everyday life in a startup. And from that perspective, we, we, we solve uh, questions in a new way, I think, as well. The connection into the, the real life, having a commercial view, understanding that uh, the, end, uh, the, the, the questions are, are not limited to one specific sphere of law. From what I experience here is, is my, my expectations at least would be a, a student uh, that has uh, has been on, on the on the startup uh, course would be better suited for uh, uh, starting as a as an attorney at law. Mm -hmm.